Today, I'm going to be revealing 10 tips to rank up in Rocket Racing. Keep watching this video till the end because I'm sure there's going to be one tip that you don't know about. Enjoy. Tip 1. Play the tutorial. This is a must if you're just starting out Rocket Racing. The tutorial will show you basic and advanced mechanics so you are prepared for your first ranked race. Even if you have to do this more than once to get the grips of the game, it's worth it. Tip 2. Press accelerate on the fourth light at the start of a race. The first thing you'll need to master in Rocket Racing is to get a 100% boost at the start of a race. You'll see four lights, three red and one green. Time these lights correctly so when the fourth one shows up, you press your acceleration button and instantly get ahead of the pack. The light time sequence will change per race, but once you've done it a few times, you'll have the extra boost mastered. Tip 3. Practice different tracks. When you start moving up in the ranks, you'll find that you start seeing more advanced tracks. If you place poorly in a track, before continuing, you should go into a private match and practice that specific track you want to master. And then after you've done that, next time you go onto the track you were struggling with, you'll be prepared and ready to take the first place spot. Also, why not practice tracks you've already played before, as you might find a new shortcut or a faster route to take. Tip 4. Always drift when possible. Drifting is a very cool mechanic in rocket racing. Always drift on corners and sometimes even on straight roads. Drifting will give you a speed boost and add to your turbo meter. But be careful not to hit any walls whilst drifting or you will lose your momentum and it may cost you the race. Also adding on to drifting, if you find yourself in a situation where you're drifting but you need to jump, keep holding the drift button to carry on your drift once you land. This is a really good tip. Sometimes this can be hard to master, but when you've got it down, you'll be boosting everywhere. Tip 5. Always go for the little green speed pads. The green speed pads are a great way to gain the advantage over your opponents. Some of these green speed pads can be in hidden spots and others in plain sight. Try and combo these green pads with a drift when it's possible as it will maximise your speed and also add to your turbo meter. And if you're struggling to hit a green pad in a certain area, once again, go into a private match and try and beat your lap every time using these pads. They're worth it. Also, adding on to the little green pads, if too many players are going for these pads, sometimes it's best to not go for it because they could knock you off track. Tip 6. Know when to use your turbo meter. If you've been taking into account the drifting tip, you'll most likely gain a lot of turbo, but knowing when to use that turbo is the priority. Using a turbo on a straight is a great way to gain distance on your fellow racers. Also, using your turbo leading up to the finish line in the last lap is great too. But never turbo during a turn as you could use that turn to gain more turbo meter. And also, you may spin out and hit a wall. Another great time to use your turbo is if you hit a red barrier which slows you down when you hit it. So use that turbo to get right back up to your previous speed and keep in the competition. Tip 7. Never fly for too long. Try and avoid flying when possible, as flying will slow your car right down. Sometimes you will need to fly, but when there's an option, it's best to stay low. Your speed gradually increases when you're on the ground, but in the air, your speed will only go down. If you're enjoying this video, why not smash a subscribe and a like? And also, comment down below what rank you currently are in Rocket Racing. Tip 8. Gain another player's slipstream. If you're having trouble passing the person in front of you, go directly behind them to gain more momentum from their exhaust fumes. Once you see little white lines behind your car, that means you can pass them. Doing this will give you a great opportunity to pass the player in front and is a great way to take advantage. But this can be hard when there's loads of players clumped up together, so if the coast is clear, go for the slipstream. Tip 9. Sometimes you will have bad games. Not every game is always a win. Sometimes it can be sad to get spun out right at the end of a match and see that 12th place pop up on your screen. But think of it as a learning curve. Grab that controller and go again. Reach that rank you want to achieve. Tip 10. Using different cars does not affect your gameplay. Sometimes people may think using a bigger car will make you slower. Well, that's false. Every car goes the exact same speed. Just be consistent in your races and you'll achieve the rank you desire. These were 10 tips to rank up in Rocket Racing. If you did enjoy, please leave a like and I'll see you in the next one.